Today is July 27th and I have um, outside a little project I've been working on. This is the mum fig, the Celeste fig. It's basically done fruiting now for the year. And this is a little project I've been working on. I tried an air layer and I put in there just um, peat moss. Straight peat moss in a, in a pot that I slid over the edge. And we'll see if we got anything here. So let's, let's get into this. All right, there we go. Looks like we might have a fig. Nah, not ready. So, all right, I'll bring y'all around to the table so you can take a look at this. Okay, so this is what we ended up with. Just a pot. Now this one, the end of this tree had a few figs on it still. I'll leave them on there. I don't, I don't think they're gonna do anything after I, now that I've taken away their, their food source. A couple little figs on there. So anyway, then I'm gonna get these potted up and I'll bring y'all along for that. Don't know how much y'all will be able to see, but I don't have my tripod, so that's what I have to do. All right. Let's see if we got any roots. And boy, do we. Look at the roots. How about that? That's pretty cool. An air layer. Roots and all. That's great. All right. So I've got a fabric. Oh, what am I going to use? Um, I've got a big old pot over here I'm going to use instead. I was thinking about using a fabric pot. But I, I think I'm just going to use a big old three gallon. I think it was a three gallon uh, plastic pot here. So y'all can see, I want this, um, I want it growing straight out. So even though that's not the same direction as it was, I'm gonna peel off some of this and see, I got some good roots back here too. So that's gonna be my, my bottom level of it. So put y'all back on here. Y'all can sort of see what's going on. Back in there. Now, I gotta drop this down a little bit. I gotta get that down to where I can down to where I can work here. Alright, too deep. Perfect. Alright. So that's where I'm gonna get my soil down to. I might be able to get two out of this. I can't break this off. Check that out. That's two. Ha <laughs> ha. That was a um, one of the limbs, so I'm gonna get two out of this. All right. So now it's time to fill it back up. This is just Miracle Grow potting soil, y'all. Um, what I had had in there was straight peat moss. Um, I have not been happy with peat moss this year and doing things other than this. This this worked out pretty well. Ah. But peat moss for the most part this year has been a disappointment. So this is Miracle Grow. This should do really well. So there you have it guys. Air layer. Instant tree. That's great. That's awesome. That's what I like to do. Okay now I got that little guy that I'm gonna put in this little that's a, uh, one gallon, half gallon, three quarter gallon. I don't know. Doesn't matter. All right, so get him just like this. A little hole in it. All right. All right, so y'all see what I'm doing. This is my little, I and mean, this was one of the branches off of there that was down in the dirt, and it has its own roots. So 
We're gonna put him down in the dirt just like that. Y'all can see what I'm doing now. It's a very simple process of putting in some more Miracle Grow potting mix, which, like I say, guys, has been better for me than just straight peat moss this year. Peat moss was a disappointment. This ought to be awesome. Okay, so there's another mum fig for you. Pot it up. So we got. Out of that one air layer, we ended up with one little tiny one. And that's a tree, y'all. I mean, that, that's three feet tall. So, sweet. So, with a minimal amount of work, just putting it on the edge of the tree, I got, I got two new trees out of it, and that's great. So, see y'all.